Hey guys, it's me, the Senile Simmer. Welcome back to my channel. If you like what you see, don't forget to hit the subscribe button. We are back with the Utopia House Challenge. You seem to enjoy the last episode, so let's see what happens this time. We are back with our Utopia Challenge. We have eight house guests. Cannot be controlled except to get them to work on their skills. We can't work on their aspirations, but they all do have aspirations. And uh, we're just going to see how long it takes them to get their skills all the way to where they need to be. And then we'll go on to phase two. We can also cannot pause. Zara has taken herself to bed. I do believe that means there are four sleeping, which means unless they want to share a bed or sleep on the couch, that's all we got. Okay. When he's done, I'm not going to ask him to do anything else. And also not going to be able to ask him to do anything else. So while they are doing what they're doing, I will show you the rules to this. So basically we have eight young adult sims with different aspirations, keeping in mind their future careers. None of the sims can be employed during the challenge. Four or less double beds, no single beds, chairs, lift seats, sofas, outdoors, benches are fine for sleeping. I reduced the household funds to a hundred simoleons. The only direction you can ever give your sims is to make them pursue their relevant skills. You can't direct them to, to, to attend to their need. You can't give them a direction that cancels the need they're already working on. So if the kitchen sink breaks while your handy sim is asleep, too bad. You cannot undertake, ask them to do a social interaction unless it's part of their relevant skills. You can't cancel or override social interactions that they started themselves. Watching a musician doesn't count as social. They, they will do that on their own. We're not paying attention to whims. We're not paying attention to the aspiration. You may not hit the pause key unless you have to go to the bathroom yourself. You can stop any sim from playing video games except the future tech guru. The only sims who pay, you may direct to leave the house are those who want to I'm sending out to do collecting. And anyone who needs fitness, you can send them jogging. No mirrors. They have to at least get their charisma skills started before they'll get charisma-based interactions. That one's going to be a really difficult one to do. But I did give them a mirror to get, get them started. No bookshelves. Again, I gave them a bookshelf, but only for reading, only for fun, not for skills. There are no skill books in the bookshelf. You may drag unfinished meals into the fridge to keep them from spoiling, but you can't do anything with dirty dishes and you can't direct a sim to clean up. They'll have to do it on their own. And there's a whole list of the relevant skills for each, which I've already taken uh, account of. Goal number one, your sims actually managed to pay the weekly bill while being unemployed and in a house big enough for eight sims. And then when they do, we're going to write down the amount of that bill. After paying the first bill, bill, we have to have saved household funds equal to what the first bill was. And then we move on to phase two, which is not important right now. So we're working on getting those skills to 10 if we can and being able to pay our, our bills. That's it. So let's go back and see if they've killed themselves while I've been looking at this page. Doesn't look like it. Look at that. Who's awake? You're sleeping on the couch. Gwendolyn, you should stop playing because your needs are in the yellow. He is wandering around looking for a bed to sleep in. He's like, nope, there's already somebody. They'll figure it out. She has figured it out. She's gone to sleep on these sofa, as has he. The only one who has not had a place to sleep is Molly. But her needs are still green, so uh, good on her. I guess we can... We'll, we'll have her go fishing a little bit more. She probably got a nap. Molly is level four fishing. Good for you, Molly. You've caught quite a few things as well. Look at that. We caught another camera. Let's sell that. We have a, a toy. Since we have no children, we can sell that. A maki, a bass, salmon, and guppy we're going to sell, and the minnow. We're selling the low-level ones because... They're not worth fertilizing with. 
Yeah, she cannot fish anymore because she needs sleep. She, I think she's found an empty bed. The problem is they're only going to nap because it's getting to be daylight. But Greg is up. Greg is tense. He's going to go get some salad for breakfast. Greg's needs are good, and he's the only one up. So let's send him to dig, look for frogs. Oh, we got harvest bluebells. We have things that can be harvested now. Dig. Harvesting, harvesting mushrooms, dig, look for frogs, harvest bluebells. We'll give those to our gardener and girl. Harvest the mushrooms, harvest bluebells. Let me speed it up a little bit. And then we'll do a harvest all, harvest the snapdragons, and make our way home. Hunter is awake. He needs the bathroom. So we'll not do anything with him until he does that. Sarah is hungry. I think we'll have her. Let's have her actually cook. She's level three now. Um, she can make aubergine parmesan. Eugene, let's have you mod Sims Forever. Molly is up. Breed a frog. We will send that to the jeweler. Send that to the Geo Council. We'll open that one. We'll give these to Molly. Open that one. We don't need these. But we'll give these to Molly. Molly, how are you need? Your needs are fine. I'm going to send her out back. And I'm going to have her plant. I'm going to plant a bluebell and a snapdragon and a strawberry and a mushroom. The other strawberries and mushrooms go into the refrigerator and her needs are good. Come out and plant everything. We're up to 1,500 smolians, which is pretty good. So we're going to have her plant and water. Got 21 smolians from book royalties. Oh, you're tense. What are you trying to do? You're doing yoga? You're a politician. Um, I mean, if it helps... It seems to be helping, so we'll let him do that. Hunter, please go for a jog. You means working on that. Uh, we'll let him sleep after that. Molly is fabulous. Rodrigo, I would like for you to come right. Let's go with another children's book. She's having a bubble bath. Sarah, what are you doing? Stop that. It's not your bonsai. Molly? Oh, she ruined it, didn't she? All right, anything you can make, make an arrangement. Um, I know we have only the ones that cost nothing. We can make bluebells right now. That's all we can do. Hunter, go practice yoga. Zara. Zara looks broke. It says she needs to eat, which she doesn't. So I'm going to reset her. And she can do whatever. Eugene. Video games, but you're in the yellow. Can't do anything. Today's mail is here. You, I'm going to have you come get the mail. I, I want to see what bills are going to be. Well, not too bad, actually. We can afford that. We'll see if it goes up at the end of the week. But in the meantime, let's get our mail. When you're done, Gwendolyn, we're going to work on handiness. We're going to craft a knife block when you're done. All right, this we can get rid of. And we can breed a frog. All right, how are your needs? Oh, you're tired. Okay, well, go to bed. What are you doing? What are you doing watching TV? Why are you not in bed? There are beds to be had. Good sir. Hunter's doing yoga. You are watching TV. Is it the cooking channel? Yes, good. Eugene, you're tired. Go to bed. Molly, coming for food. We're cleaning up food. I don't know. She's tired. You are writing a book. When is working on a thing? Oh, Molly, we're going to sell that. Good job. Twelve dollars. Can I sell these on Plopsy? I can. Let's try that. Let's list these things on Plopsy. You are exhausted. I don't know why you're not going to bed. 
see you're doing fine with your yoga. You are cleaning up because that's what you do. Eugene isn't bad. I you, you are sleeping. Are you sleeping or napping? You're napping. Oh, can I make them sleep? Probably not. Bren, are you napping? No, you're just sitting there. There you go for a nap. Rodrigo is doing well. As is Gwendolyn. Gwendolyn, can you come craft? <gasps> you can make furniture. Let's start with a bar stool. Who's freezing to death? Uh, please stop. There you go. Stop playing yoga. Come inside. Good job. I didn't even have to have you do it. You did it on your own. I'm very impressed. Since you can't do yoga because it's too cold, I would like for you to go jogging. I wish you'd do more than just nap. There are empty beds. Why don't you people use them? I'm going to make it really difficult. Rodrigo finished his book. Rodrigo. I know you're watching TV. You don't really need to. Go ahead and self-publish that book. Thank you very much. And then go back and start writing a new one. Do a book of poetry this time. You Are you dying, sir? What are you doing? Okay, you're not stuck. Because you've decided to eat. Okay. You, I want you to go jogging again. All right, what are you up to? He's going to play some scuffle. That is okay. You can do that. Why don't you people go to bed? Gwendolyn, what is wrong with you? You got a boo-boo. Yeah, you did. It's fine. Oh, you have handiness. When you're done chatting with Rodriguez, maybe you'll fix the toilet. She's sleeping in a bush. Oh, my goodness. Sims, be like. Napping? Who are you chatting with? Just don't freeze to death, okay? She's in a good mood, um, but she's chat chitter-chattering. I can't stop her. Hmm. He's home. He needs a bath. Okay, well, nobody's going to fix that toilet anyway. You are sleeping. You, Greg, is probably napping, yes. Hunter is taking a bath. Zara is very playful. Jean is taking a nap on the couch. Or, yeah. Molly's chit-chatting. You really should go to bed, folks. Those who need it. Olivia Kim Lewis has come to knock on our door. We didn't get a welcome wagon, which is really odd. So they don't know anybody outside the family. Or the household, I should say. They're not family. Coming to get something to eat. Zara is watching the cooking channel. Eugene has sleep energy needs. As does Molly. Don't go in a bush, Molly. There are beds. I do not understand why you would nap in a bush. She takes that bush right out of here. Rodrigo is hungry. I can't make him do anything right now. He's getting food. You're in a good mood. Can you fix the toilet? No, because... Oh, somebody already did fix the toilet. Cool. All right, come out here and... Give me another sculpture. Another piece of furniture. Do a garden pot. I mean, you're playful, but you're tired. I can't do anything with you. Still napping. Talking with Hunter on Zara. Eugene is, I'm guessing, napping. They don't sleep. Rodrigo, you are a writer. I would like for you... Oh, go do something fun. Because he's got writer's block. Okay, well, we'll come back to you later, I guess. Yay, somebody who's actually sleeping. Whoop, oh, uh, Greg is also sleeping, so that's good. You need to go to the bathroom. Oh, you're also ill. Cool. Can you? I'm going to go ahead and have you. Oh, I can't. You'll get over it, right? Go to the bathroom. Everything will be fine. You also need to go to the bathroom. You are... Just getting up from a nap and need to go to the bathroom. Molly needs sleep. You need sleep. Yeah, you want to go chat with Yuki. I'm going to have you do that. Exactly that. I would like... I can't pause, Yuki. Um, let's do a funny introduction. Because I want to do some mischief. Oh, shoot. You have to go to the bathroom. Darn it. <sighs> Never mind. Why don't you take care of your needs? Go to the bathroom and go to bed. What are you doing? Fertilizing. 
We have two bathrooms. Are they both broke? Is that a thing? Not broke. Not broke. But you'd rather use the bush. The bush is there for an emergency. In case, you know, both things are broke. Oh, this one is still broke. My bad. You have to pee and sleep. Who's the other person that likes handiness? I don't know if they'll do it on their own. Their needs are not good, guys. You have to pee. What are you doing? Oh, you can stop playing video games because you have to pee. Molly has found a bed. Good. You have found a bed. When? No, there's somebody in there, darling. Why don't you find a bathroom? Worry about the bed later. There's no bed for you. Oh, Zara's level five cooking. Zara, did you cook something? I don't know what you cooked, but you're looking for a bed. Oh, these guys, they just run around from room to room to room. Like, nope, there's somebody in there. You woke her up. Was she all right? All right. I think that's okay. I mean, she's fine. You know what you can do? <laughs> Go practice your guitar. You'll be up soon. Unless you're crawling in bed with them, find a toilet. If I can get Gwendolyn in a good mood when she wakes up, so maybe I can get her to repair things. Did you just kick her out? And then he came and kicked you out. That's so rude. They're playing musical beds. It's terrible. You have to pee is what you have to do. Not sleep. Oh, my goodness. But you'd rather look for a bed. Go pee, dummy. All right. Asuka, let's practice piano. Level four. These guys just keep kicking each other out of the bed. It's terrible. You are going to pee your pants, sir. That toilet is not broke. You can use it. Why aren't they using the bathroom? Okay, well, you've had a bladder failure now. Cool. Well, was that fun for you? Mop that up. All right. There are no beds. Go to the bathroom. I don't know what your problem is, but, you know, once you pee, maybe you'll, I don't know, take a shower. No sense mopping that. It's, oh, my goodness. What are you doing, sir? Stop mopping that puddle. No, don't, don't. Can you take a bath or a shower? No, don't look for a bed. Oh, my God, you're disgusting. Well, they're having fun. And if this is where we cut it for today, this has been day two. And I will leave you with hugs and cookies. And I will see everyone later. That's going to do it for this episode. Thank you so much for watching. Don't forget to hit that subscribe button. There are two new videos down below that you can watch. Leave a comment if you'd like. I usually do reply. Hit the like button to share it on your Twitter. I can be found on Twitter and also on Twitch. And above all, have a really great day. Bye-bye.